Hello, I'm Thomas Rohde, Archbishop of Mobile. And as this year of the Eucharist in the parish approaches its close, this year of the Eucharist in the parish that we have been celebrating in our archdiocese since last November, a, a word about the Mass as being a celebration of what we will have for all eternity. You know, in the Bible, the last book of the Bible is the book of Revelation. And in it, it describes what the angels and saints are doing in the presence of God. The, the description is Jesus as the Lamb of God, Jesus as the bridegroom who is marrying his bride, the church, being united for all eternity. And the whole description uh, of this in the Bible is very similar to the description of Mass. The Lamb of God is at the altar, and the angels and saints are gathered around the altar, praising God, singing, holy, holy, holy. Uh, on earth, at Mass, to the best that we can do as, as human beings, we are celebrating at Mass, what is being celebrating, celebrated in the presence of, of Christ for all eternity. We are being united with our brothers and sisters who have gone ahead of us to be with God for all eternity in the celebration of Mass. We on earth say, holy, 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 and we are united with Jesus Christ when we receive his real presence in the Eucharist as we'll be united with Christ for all eternity when we are joined together with Christ in his presence. And so may the Eucharist truly be a source of strength in our faith to remind us of what we are called to. We are called to be in the presence of Jesus Christ with those who have gone before us and with the angelic creatures for all eternity, praising Christ, holy, holy, holy. May God bless you.